But I found uh, the best way to flip reset in this ball is just to lean back at the last second. This type of ball that's coming at you, just to lean back and let it let let it hit the belly of the car. And then you can kind of chase after it, like like that. <laughs> there you go. Ah, oh, it was going in as well. No, oh, why didn't it hit the bar? Flip reset, double touch. By the way, oh, it's not gone fast enough. Past midnight in EU? Oh, by a long way, mate. By a long way. Oh, here we go. Big flip recycle! Oh, I wave dashed! <laughs> that was not intentional. Okay, I missed it. Whoops. One day, I was just like trying to like uh, figure out how to air dribble out of a ball like this. And I ended up realizing that it's a really good way to get a flip reset set up. If you can, I mean, this is a bit far away from the backboard. To be fair, the ball's like quite likely to fall. It's quite hard hard to hit it like all the way to the backboard from here. P one C C four P one two C four. Sorry, thanks to the four months. Seeing the recent man. results of the invites to the salt mine, would you change how invites work for future tournaments? Um, Maybe less invites or no invites at all. Oh, there would definitely be invites, like. I, I believe that the defending champions should always get a chance to defend their their title. Just like how, you know, in many sports competitions, you get, um, you know, defending champions get to come back, even if they fail to qualify, or they don't even have to qualify, they just get, they just get invited back, you know? I think that's fine. Uh, and then, like, some players just deserve invites. They, they don't, they shouldn't have to try and qualify. Because the, the fact of the matter is, no one is good enough to guarantee qualification, uh, but some players deserve to just be in the t in a tournament. Um, for example, you look at Fairy Peak and what he's done in 1v1 in the past year. Of course, he deserves an invite to the salt mine. You know, it's like an it's like a no-brainer. Oh! <laughs> what a goal! <laughs> Counts. Absolutely counts, mate. Right, here we go. We're on it. Hey, we did one. <laughs> I'm Kirby. Thanks for the 16 month prime. Appreciate it. Flip reset, double touch from two yards out. Oh, it's not gone high enough. Yeah, some players just deserve to auto qualify. The same, like, if you think about it, like RLCS, right? Every year, the top. Like whatever teams, six teams, are invited back every year. They're all invited back. Um, but well, before this year when you know it's expanding. But you know what I mean. So they're inviting back more of a percentage of players. But since one v one is less established and has less history, I'm skipping. Like I, I don't, I don't really agree with the qualification process for. Um, RLCS season one, really. I, I, if I was in charge, I would have done it differently. I think it was pretty fair. I think it was a good system, you know, doing uh, open qualifiers, double elimination. It was, it was okay. But if it was me, I would have definitely invited like some teams straight in. Teams like uh, Flipside, they shouldn't have to qualify. Uh, teams like IBP, they shouldn't have to qualify. They're, they're too good to like have to qualify for this. And the way to do it would have just been to hand out some seeds up at the bar. Like, hand out some seeds to um, teams based on, or some invites to teams rather, based on uh, tournament results in recent times. I actually nearly scored that. Have you heard the K-Dop news? No, what's the, what's the K-Dop news? I've not checked Twitter today if there's been anything there. Gazar, thanks to the 41 month Twitch Prime. No, sorry, Tier 1. That sub is older than Twitch Prime itself. Really appreciate it, man. That's insane. Alright, that wasn't a flip reset double touch, but I'll take it. That was actually a pretty good goal. It's literally Paul, thanks to the year of Tier 1. Appreciate it, man. I wonder if anybody could, like, just flip reset double touch every single shot in this pack first try. Is anybody that good? Probably several people are that good. What's up? Hydro Flood, thanks to the two-month Twitch Prime. Welcome back. 
I think 41 months is all the months right now. I believe that is all of them. I've hit this ball so hard to get the flip reset on it. And also hit the backboard with it. Like, you almost have to mess up your aerial by flying too low and then get up into it. Yeah, like that. That's what we're going for. Ah. Like, fly too low and then at the last second, you come back up and into it. And then you can get some really good distance on it. For the rebound! Ah. Oh! That's my trail. It's a purple standard. Thanks for all the entertaining content oh! and informal tips, homie. I'm almost a freestyler and I'm also nearly Jesse. I nearly saved my own shot. No one, not many people can be a freestyler and Jesse. In the same play. I <laughs> somehow missed that. <laughs> the EU salt mine was fantastic. Best league to date. The rest of this gauntlet and world's about to be lit. Yeah, Grim Dark Flame, that's my thoughts exactly. I'm not sure what to say to this. It's a really terrible meme, if that's a meme. Uh, John Dick... John... Uh, Dick Urbano. Thanks to the 33 month tier one. Uh, you saw me some fantastic best league to date. Just the gauntlet and we're all about to be lit. Yeah, it's gonna be great, man. I hope you hope you like it. Choosing Toast, thanks to the four month tier one, welcome back. And also Souls with the eleven month prime, welcome. So I figured out how to do this, kind of. Eh. So you gotta like fly too low and then go up into it, and the ball goes absolutely flying. Double flip reset! I'm insane. What's this uh where where what does this mean? What? I don't get it. Dub, thanks for the three quid. So I noticed Five Magics changed his name to Festive Magics, so to be festive myself, I changed my name to Dubmas. What do you think? Does it work or is it a bit of a stretch? Lul sp 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 sp. Thomas, I like it actually. That's pretty good. It's a nice ring to it, not gonna lie. Rhinus83, thanks for the Prime sub. Appreciate it. Oh, I know. Are you guys all saying Rip Kate up because he tweeted out last stream in uh, like one of his tweets earlier today? But he meant last stream before Worlds, obviously. There we go. Flip reset rebound. Insane. It's just straight in the top corner, isn't it? I don't think I got the, don't think I got the flip there. Man. It's a really like different flight path to the ball to get it to pop up like really far on these like flip resets. You have to really be going up quite hard, like uh, up and into the ball. Look at that. Look how high it pops when you do that. It's mad if you're like flying upwards into it. How do we join? I'm going to make a tournament right now, but I just wanted to test this first. Look at that. <laughs> Did you see the little jump there? Imagine going for a flip reset in that situation. What do you mean, imagine? I'm doing it. Oh, I didn't get the flip reset though. You don't have to imagine. I don't think I got it there either. No, I would have scored if I had it. But it's like a proper mind game. Imagine you're just like, oh yeah, so I'm gonna just pop this ball up into the air and then flick it in, you know? No one's gonna see this coming. This is the this is the move right here. <laughs> how do you how do you read this? It's like a ceiling double touch flip reset. Like, if I can do this, like, if I could do it, like, this well, there. <laughs> I want to see somebody scoring it in RLCS this weekend. Bah! There we go. Bang! Close. Very nice. Excellent. Exactly what I meant to do. Bah! <laughs> Don't even have a flip reset. But I'm, it's curious, because I was just like messing around and I was trying to like start air dribbles out of the air and I was like, wow, this ball like really pops quite far when you do this, when you fly up too low. Like, you know when you see people in lower rating games and they're trying to, you know, do a fast area like that where they reach the ball nice and high and put it on target and then they're like, oh no, I'm too low and you see them flying in, but they're like flying in like this because they're, they're too low and they're trying to reach it. Like, Type one in chat if you've seen somebody in your lobby today flying for an area like this, and then they're like, oh no, okay, hold on, let me just, they're, they're like leaning backwards like this, because they've gone way too low, and they just go straight past it. Yeah, I do that, yeah, yeah. Well, the funny thing is, to get this pop, 
that's what you have to do. You have to be too low, or it has, has to feel like you're you're flying in too low, and then you like last second you fly up into it, and then miss the ball. I feel personally attacked. Hey, we've all been there, some of us today. I mean, me literally right now. But yeah, look at the difference if you fly, like if you just go up normally and let the ball hit you, it kind of like falls down. But if you like come up with the last second, like you do a basically a really slow aerial. It kicks the ball up in the air really far while getting a reset. Look at that. Look how far that goes. We're at the halfway line here, boys. <laughs> We're just setting up a double touch. No problem. I wonder how much boost that was. Did I did I use more than 100 boost here? <laughs> new mechanic? <laughs> it's just like... Uh, it's not a new mechanic. Like Everybody knows about this already. It's just like a reliable way to get a mad pop on the ball with a reset. It's all about the timing. Oh, hold on a second, boys. I almost triple touched it. Are you joining Pulse? I am not joining Pulse, no. Look at that, though. It's mental. <laughs> it goes so far. I don't think I got a reset here. Oh, I did. <gasps> I messed up. I messed up. Yeah, hurry. Go, 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 go. Now I'm going to do some more silly flip reset double touch things in the meantime. This one might actually be quite hard because the ball is going away from me. How do you launch this one into the backboard with a flip reset? How is this possible? Oh there you go. See like see that though? It just like pops off if you hit if you catch it in the right part of the car. It just like flies away. Like everybody's wanting to get those flip resets where the ball stays close to you, but what if somebody mastered Getting the flip resets where they deliberately pop it miles away from themselves, and then they also have a reset. This isn't a particularly good shot to do it on, I wouldn't recommend it on things like this. <clears throat> Too slow. You don't see the tournament, you uh, might have to look again. Wait. <coughs> what? Wait a minute, what is O'Neill's subpar button HD pack? Look at this. You can't see it on PC? Look at me, clearing the ball. Beautiful. And into the goal, off the wall. How does he do it? Wait, what is this? What are we doing here? I don't know what the goal of this is. Are we supposed to like run away and then absolutely blast this ball into the goal or something? Oh, <laughs> okay. Don't get your D key stuck down or else you'll oversteer. Got Doritos stuck in there, probably. Imino oh my goodness! Beans in chat my, to make it my turning is so heavy. What am I supposed to do with this? Make sure you have cross-platform play turned on. Yeah, if you can't find it, um, just try maybe and restart it or restart your game. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing here. I'm not entirely sure what the aim is. Hey, Lord, thanks for the tenor, man. Really appreciate that. I just wanted Dutch to thank you for making well. such a great tourney with the salt mine. I went through a dark period this fall and the NAR episodes gave me something to look forward to every day. I'm sure many others felt this way. Your work is so appreciated. Uh, that means a lot to me, man. And yeah, I'm glad I could, uh, I'm glad I could help out. Really, I am. It's so late. Yeah, it's pretty late. Yeah, large. It's really good. To, to hear. It motivates me to do it again next year. Already thinking about that, not gonna lie. I wanna do it again. I can't get this to pop into the back wall. Like I said uh, in my last stream, I'm thinking about doing Salt Mine live next year. We'll obviously still put it on YouTube. <coughs> but I'm thinking to do it live as well. One minute, guys. Max score three. Yeah, because with these mutator settings, it's very hard to score. Well, maybe not very hard, but it's definitely, I would call it hard. There we go. Little flip reset air dribbly dribble. Xenocide tears for 100 bits, mate. Am I doing? Ready to get slapped to the tournament? With that, it should, yes. I'm like trying purposely to fly too low under the ball and then have to recover 
because that seems to be the best way to set these up with uh, resets. That's a floor pinch, lol. How can we get Silex to buy into sponsoring Salt Mine? Maybe they'll want to after how amazing it was this year. Alright, 